My name is Stuart McNeil. I'm an educator here at the Intrepid Sea, Air, and Space Museum. And today, I'd like to talk to you about Cartesian divers. What are Cartesian divers? Well, Cartesian divers are like small submarines. However, unlike regular submarines, which sink by taking on water and changing their mass, Cartesian divers sink by changing the volume of an air bubble on the inside of them. Our Cartesian diver is the end of a pipette with a hex nut on it. But you can make yours at home out of something as simple as a soy sauce packet. Now we'll put it in here to test to see if it floats. And as you can see, it floats just under the surface. So now we'll put it in our two liter bottle and you'll get a chance to see why we call it a Cartesian diver. When I apply pressure to the bottle, I apply pressure to the water and the air bubble on the inside. The air bubble actually gets compressed, making it take up less space and lowering its volume. Lower volume equals greater density, meaning that it sinks. When I let go, the bubble expands and it rises. Objects sink when they become denser than the water that surrounds them. We can show this in two ways. We can increase the mass, as in when a submarine takes on water, or decrease the volume, as in our Cartesian divers. Come and visit us at the Intrepid Museum. See what life was like on board our Growler submarine, and check out our new interactive exhibit, Submerged. Thanks for watching. Keep experimenting and exploring, and be sure to visit us online at intrepidmuseum.org.